Uh, good morning. Uh, well, actually, it's already afternoon, 1 o'clock on Monday afternoon, February the 1st. And a friend of mine had brought an, a situation to my attention about 10,000 children uh, that are missing in Europe. And so this morning I did a DNA reading and uh, to find out exactly what was going on. And what had happened also is another ship had come in uh, from the Sombrero Galaxy. And uh, it had uh, 76 reptilians and they also brought in a lot of demons. And before, a couple of years ago, when we were sending demons into the light, it was actually quite a process because the vibration was so different back then than it is now. And now it's actually become very simplified. We just create globes of the silver-violet flame and then a tunnel of light. And within seconds, the demons are gone. There's like no battle that takes place anymore, uh, no energy transfers or anything. So things have really dramatically changed. Now, these ships, uh, you know, when I was talking to, um, you know, my guys and people in heaven, they're telling me that they're coming in because uh, they've been planning to do this uh, Nazi takeover. Uh, uh, again, they basically want to repeat the same thing that was done in Nazi Germany, uh, only here in America. And that's why we have concentration camps uh, all over this country. And the child trafficking is a big part of that because when you uh, exhibit this type of behavior um, such as cannibalism, the raping of children, and the murdering of children, and all three of these are heavily involved with the child trafficking situation in the United States, it generates frequencies. And uh, it creates, uh, in, in other words, it creates an energy uh, which enables... Uh, more nefarious intent plans to be carried through. But the problem that they're having is now is that the vibrations have lifted up so much due to the ascension of this planet because we're moving up into the fifth dimension. Well, not all of us, because not all people will be able to handle that uh, transition. And um, so things have really changed. And what I found was uh, that uh, just recently, 10,952 children um, have been uh, taken from four countries and then distributed to 71 locations in Europe. And uh, a lot of these um, children with these four countries, uh, the first country is Syria. And uh, in the United States war crime against Syria, the United States has murdered 3,076,145 people in Syria as of today. And the United States has cleverly blamed Assad and several military groups such as ISIS, but they're all paid for and trained uh, by and given weapons by the United States of America, mostly CIA. The Pentagon is overseeing this war crime and there is intent uh, the Pentagon's intent is to murder as many people as uh, possible and then to occupy this country and steal its resources, which are mostly oil. They basically want to uh, drill for uh, new oil and take the resources that they already have. And um, out of Syria, 9,146 children have been taken from Syria into the child trafficking. Uh, the next country is the war crime against the Ukraine. Um, as you know, uh, in the U.S., uh, United States of America's war crime against the Ukraine, the United States has murdered 1,767,002 people and blamed basically everybody else on the planet for it. And this war crime is almost a carbon copy of what the Nazis did in World War II because this, uh, in the Ukraine, it was just like Germany. They had concentration camps. They were murdering people as fast as they could. And the, the funny thing, well not funny, but funny strange thing, is that 17 members of the State Department are uh, Nazi war criminals who were in the Ukraine in World War II. They're just now in different bodies. John Kerry and Victoria Newland are two of those people. They're the exact same people that committed the crimes uh, before.
1954, and that's why they were specifically uh, selected. John Kerry murdered over 17,000 people in World War II in the Ukraine, and Victoria Newland uh, was a Nazi officer. She was a male then, uh, and she murdered uh, just over 32,000 people in the Ukraine during World War II. And uh, right now, the statistics, uh, Russia has killed 37 people. Now, the United States war criminals are blaming all this, uh, all this death and destruction in Ukraine on Russia, but uh, the Russians have only killed 37 people, and the United States was uh, just under 1.8 million. Uh, and uh, 297 children have been abducted in the Ukraine for this child trafficking event. Uh, the next country is Iraq, and uh, which you know everybody knows about the United States war crime against Iraq. And uh, the United States has murdered 7.9 million people. 7, 7,965,456 Iraqis have been murdered. And this has all been done for profit and human sacrifice. And, and well, they also had a, uh, a large star, a Stargate or something there. I don't, I don't really understand, you know, what, what that was all about. I haven't really had time to look at that. And Iraq, 456 children were pulled uh, for this child trafficking event. And um, the last country uh, was Yemen. And um, in the United States war crimes against Yemen, over the past 20 years, 602,986 people have been murdered there. And uh, just recently, uh, uh, well, in the past a uh, little bit, 1,053 children were taken from Yemen into this uh, uh, situation where 10,952 uh, children have been taken. And um, these children were collected from these four countries and then transported to the Vatican and where they were taken underground. And uh, then these children were delivered to 71 countries all across Europe. I'm sorry, 71 locations all across Europe, including the CIA headquarters uh, in Lake Geneva. And um, there, uh, I just found out today, there's a wonderful site called truthernews.wordpress.com. And it's an HTTPS site for truthernews.wordpress.com. And they have a huge amount of information about the CIA headquarters. And I, I wasn't really aware, but apparently there's an underground uh, tunnel between Italy and the CIA headquarters, which has a lot to do with transporting of children. And one of these, uh, this is part of, we're getting really close to this, um, major event, which we're calling the America Takedown, and which I don't believe for a second that will happen. And Heaven said, told me this morning that uh, the frequencies are way too high here on the planet Earth for them to pull this off. But you know, I was recently really, I, I, I kept telling myself, I wonder how could I miss this? How could I miss this? Because recently I had seen, you know, when I was looking at the souls and the DNA of people that almost all the Nazi war criminals uh, that murdered so many in World War II are actually in new bodies here in the America, in America. And um, they had this full intent of committing this uh, war crime again, and uh, they want to wipe out as many humans as possible, but I don't, I don't see any way possible that this, this could be possible. And uh, then Heaven says the same. But uh, Heaven asked me to be patient because we went through another, you know, the 76 reptilians. But they were coming in because they want to feed off of this. But the problem is uh, that group by group, I think we've had 60, 67 ships have come in from other locations to participate in this killing. But uh, all of them have been arrested. It's been quite a process because each of these people have to be transfigured and then their energy transmuted. And once that happens, then the galactics can't arrest them because you can't just pull 
uh, a dark entity up from this reality up to the higher level of the fifth dimension because they'll, they'll just die. They, I don't really know exactly what would happen if they would explode or whatever, but the vibration is too much. And this is why people with low vibrations don't go to heaven when they die because you have to be, you have to have a, a certain amount of sacred light uh, in your being to ascend to heaven when you die. And a lot of the religious people think that when you die, someone else externally is going to come and save you. But that's not the case. The case is very simple, that you either have enough sacred light to generate your tunnel, uh, or you don't. And um, But I wanted to bring attention to everyone about these uh, 10,000 children. You know, they've been doing uh, child sacrifice uh, in Europe for thousands and thousands of years before uh, we have here in the United States. And um, it's just an incredibly unfortunate situation. But um, I really uh, hope that we're close to the end because this work has been exhausting. And, um, you know, thank you for your prayers for these children. And we are definitely making huge milestones uh, you know, with all these arrests of people involved. And uh, Heaven told me last night that there's a very specific list of things that need to be done and then mass arrests will occur where a little over 600,000 people will be arrested in the United States. And most of those uh, are all these people that are involved in the child trafficking here in my lab, um, in the my lab, um, DARPA, CIA, FBI controlled um locations. Thank you so much and have a nice day. God bless your hearts.